take control of our energy situation the gentleman from florida ms ross layton and is now recognized for five minutes mr speaker this year americans worked almost a one hundred days from january first to april ninth to pay taxes at the federal state and local levels which is more than one fourth of their income i believe that it is totally unacceptable to require already stressed families to give up such a high share of their income while bloated federal bureaucracies continue to expand during a severe recession to reduce this burden congress should now focus on reforming the current complicated tax structure which makes it so much difficult so uh, so much more difficult for families and small business owners to experience economic recovery as as i called for in my last speech on tax reform the chairman of the house ways and means committee the gentleman from michigan mr levin needs to schedule hearings on tax reform simplicity as soon as possible the fair tax proposal is one of those ideas that i believe the committee must consider the fair tax is definitely a serious proposal that is backed by many americans including so many constituents of my congressional district and it deserves our full consideration the fair tax would replace all federal income and payroll based taxes with a national retail sales tax and includes a rebate to ensure that no american below the poverty level pays federal taxes if enacted the fair tax proposal would provide a dollar for dollar federal revenue neutrality according to the proposals advocates the fair tax would reform the current tax code today's tax code is unfair costly and confusing and is so complex that many of us pay more in taxes per year than we should it is estimated that the present system cost taxpayers two hundred and sixty five billion dollars for tax filing tax record keeping tax reduction advice etc which is nine hundred dollars for every man woman and child in america this is taxation without comprehension the current income tax code therefore inhibits economic growth it inhibits capital formation and most importantly it inhibits job creation fair tax supporters believe it it can correct that this the tax reform can correct these problems by greatly reducing the high cost of compliance in the present system while lifting the income tax burden on production i believe that a fair and balanced look at the fair tax should begin the conversation on tax reform and i encourage my colleagues who are about having this discussion to join me in contacting the chairman congress needs to remember the sacrifices that are made by each american family by making a real effort at tax reform this year as the american economy continues to stagnate with a record ten percent unemployment rate congress needs to respond by taking a close look at tax reform and yes the fair tax also i thank the speaker for the time the uh, gentleman from florida mr klein is now recognized for five minutes thank you